Hello everybody, I'm Nilo K and welcome back to my channel. Thank you so much to everybody who's here to watch another video. If you are new, welcome. Please do not forget to subscribe. So in today's video, I'll be doing a get to know me tag. I've asked my friend to send me questions that she thinks you guys might be interested in knowing about me. So I'll be answering those questions, but of course I'll do like an updated get to know me tag. Maybe when we get to a thousand subbies, I'll put the poll on my Instagram so you guys can ask the questions there. If you do not follow me on Instagram, please make sure that you do right now. It is at Nele underscore K. And also I just wanted to address something. I'll be posting every single week, but I don't want to dedicate any day to it because guys, it really gets so hectic during the week nine to five and 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 so i can get a little bit disappointed if i do not post on like a wednesday but it is definitely every single week so yeah without wasting any of your time let's get straight into the video okay cool first question are you an introvert or an extrovert i'm definitely ambivert i'm just in the middle of introvert and extrovert it really depends who am i dealing with do you have any piercings or tattoos? I don't have any tattoos. I, I don't even think I'm brave enough to get a tattoo. Hey, I'm Tulsa. But I do have piercings, just the ones that I got as a baby. And I used to have a tongue ring, which I removed, I think, eight years back or seven. I got that in varsity anyway. Does your name have any special meaning? It does. I think my mom was just so excited to have a baby girl and that's what she wanted and hence the name Ginele. and I'm honestly a gift to so many people <laughs> and you guys <laughs> what is your most embarrassing moment yo I think a friend of mine had a birthday party we're still in matric or first year sharp or I will never forget when we got there we had shots J and B I'm the girl that I think I am. Sharp, but then it's time to leave. I get home. Garobala. Hey, I saw Tlats and Magella Tlats at some bed. And at that moment, I can't even move. I had to sleep on top of my puke. I woke up in the morning, I think around 5, and I tried to wash the things off before my mom could wake up. But it was too early. That girl wakes up very early. Yo! Ah, that was so embarrassing. I'm Pozadita Vatsakul, left, right, and center. That was really, really embarrassing. Have you ever shot your shot? Tell the story. If not, why not? <laughs> no, I haven't actually. I haven't. I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> right <laughs> you know i don't know i think i'm just too shy what's the goal you you would like to accomplish between now and 2022 um one thing that i've always wanted to do after my 20s was to build a family and that is what i'm looking forward to and just grow in my career grow in my business and build a beautiful family that is my goal What's the most expensive item you own and does it have any meaning to your life? Expensive? I don't have any expensive. Or I can actually let you like expensive things. Between the two. <laughs> I don't think I have anything expensive. But one of my biggest purchases was my car. That's the only thing. But yeah, I don't have anything expensive yet. If money was not a subject, what would you get for your birthday? <sighs> Maybe a card with money. <laughs> um, definitely a house. Yeah. If you could live anywhere in the world, where would it be and why? Anywhere closest to my family. Yeah. I think I love the fact that I can drive to go see my grandmother. I can spend time with my mom. I, I really love being around my family, guys. So, uh, a nice house in Pretoria? I wouldn't mind, honestly. 
to be very honest with you as long as they're here i'm happy another question what drives you to achieve more the fact that i've got such a long list of things that i would love to experience the fact that i've got um a goal to live a soft life do you understand that gives me purpose that gives me reason to wake up and do more and just work hard to achieve that yeah what is your favorite color definitely white i love anything white white is such a clean and no man you can play around with white i just am in love with white who is your role model my mommy i love that woman Mm -mm. she really is a go-getter she does everything that she wants to do she works hard she gets anything that she wants <sighs> that is a true definition of a role model i look up to her in everything that i do i look up to that woman do you consume alcohol or have you ever tasted alcohol if not why i do not consume alcohol i have tasted alcohol listen uh, alcohol i see the attack like uh that thing firstly i'm not that's the first thing secondly i just hate the fact that it makes you act out of character like i i hate not being in control of myself like with a sort of because you know so no thanks no pass would you smash my purisa <laughs> No, sorry, Mara. Mm -mm. mm -mm. Like, I keep to come out. Sorry, but you know, just preference. Did you like school? <laughs> I did, obviously, for about fun of the body. I'm joking. I did, I did like school. I did not fully like studying like most of us, but yeah i did like school what top three principles you live by daily firstly being very kind very very kind secondly um spreading love that is the biggest principle that i love just having so much love to give and thirdly always i always remind myself that not everything is about me just to always think about the next person and to think that people are going through the most out there so yeah those are the questions and i really do hope that you guys enjoyed this video and got to understand a few things about me if you did enjoy the video please give it a thumbs up also do comment down below if you would love to see something different on the channel do not forget to subscribe if you haven't subscribed already thank you so so much guys for watching get and in my next video bye